So I'm working on page 24 today. As soon as I finish this page, it's time to start coloring. Maybe I should have colored them as I go instead of inking first and then coloring. I had no idea how long this was really going to take. Because as I said earlier, artists don't know what we're doing. We do not know what we are doing. Uh, where's his right shoulder? What am I going to do about his right shoulder? Maybe nobody will notice. Throughout, what is your best use of dramatic foreshortening? Throughout, what is your best use of dramatic foreshortening? Uh, are you talking about? Best use of dramatic foreshortening. Well, uh, I'm assuming you're talking about figure drawing. So things that are. I really don't use a lot of foreshortening. I don't think this book lends itself to dramatic foreshortening. Uh, when I think of foreshortening, I think of uh, things like Spider-Man, where he's swinging through the air, and you can see that his, his back foot is really tiny, and his uh, the fist that is grabbing the, the web is really big. In front of his face, in front of his face. So, um, so I'm sorry to disappoint you, <laughs> uh, but uh, there's not a lot of action in this book yet. 
I'm sorry to say. There's a lot of walking and talking, as you can see. This is the best way that I can make walking and talking look exciting. Making them look excited about uh, what he's saying. Uh, let's see, by the way, what this looks like without... Oh, I missed a spot here. Let's get this brush and connect this line here. Oh, I forgot to do this again. After I reverted, I have to go back to this that I've already done. Are you a fan of foreshortening? Is that what you're, is that why you're asking? All right, let's do another head. I like to start with the nose. Are you an artist as well, Kit Beardstone? Oh, wait a minute. More because composition tells so much of the story, bringing in those extreme angles can help with the, the storyline, even on non-action sequences. You sound like you are an artist, Kit Beardstone. Are you an art streamer? Do you have a, a channel? that I can shout out. You've probably already told me. I'm sorry. I apologize for my horrible memory. I do like when people do it well. Uh, Todd McFarlane. You have a background in art. Uh, I changed my name over from Kit Livingstone about a month ago. Let me see. Let me find your channel. Oh uh, yes, you do a lot of you 
uh, play hunting games. I remember, I remember you now. Do a lot of hunting. Uh, I believe you do wood burning or wood carving. 